Susan Kay here, and I'm just taking my dogs for a walk at the park. I wasn't feeling too good today, and uh, I just wanted to say I'm so grateful that I didn't have to call in sick to anybody, because, you know, I'm my own boss. I said, it's okay, you stay home. <laughs> That's what you do anyways. But um, the dogs were getting restless, so I decided to take them out for a walk. I'm using a mic today, so hopefully the sound will be good quality. And, you know, just wanted to get my video in for the day. And come on. Want to see my dogs? There they are. I don't know if you can. Little crazy things, huh? Come on. Got to stop and sniff everything. Seriously. They have shiny object, object syndrome worse than I do. Anyways, I was just thinking about how grateful I was that I didn't have to call in sick or leave anybody stranded today because I wasn't feeling well. And it got me to think about all the things that I'm grateful for, even though I do do gratitude every morning. Um, I, you know, I was at lunch with my friend the other day and we were talking about, you know, gratitude and she said she's got a gratitude book and everything. And I, and she's like, but I kind of ran out of things to be grateful for. I'm like, oh, you never run out of things to be grateful for, like hot water and walls and blue sky and oxygen and, you know, sometimes I wake my daughter up. I remember when I first started doing gratitude and I would wake my daughter up and she'd be so cranky. I'd be like, what are you grateful for today? She'd be like, air. <laughs> and that's a good thing to be grateful for. You know, you got to be grateful that you have all your limbs and your eyesight and you can talk and... You know, even though I'm feeling a little crappy, I'm so glad that's all I feel is is just <laughs> kind of crappy. So, um, I just thought I'd touch on that gratitude. And, you know, if you don't know what to be grateful for, then just imagine being in a desert with nothing and, uh, and think about all the things that you have because you're not in that desert. You know, water, a toilet, uh, food or you know even people to talk to friends cranky animals that won't listen to you when you try and walk them <laughs> it's it's important and it's even more important not only to just be grateful for the little things but it's also great you should be grateful for the opportunities that you have in life and you should definitely take advantage of those opportunities you know because we weren't put here to to complain and moan and and be miserable it's true and we weren't put here to be average although that's what 90% of the population has accepted to become so if you're watching this and if you want to know more information about the opportunity that I have and that I've taken to uh, be able to stay homesick and walk my dogs then please click on the link below and I will get back to you with more information okay so you have a great day and never give up <laughs>